as the makers behind world-class project management software, we've seen our fair share of high-budgeted projects. So today, we thought we'd do something a bit different and look at the most expensive projects of all time, something you definitely need soda to help manage. Shameless plug right there. We've compiled a list of some of the most expensive projects we could find and have adjusted them for inflation in 2020. From airports to space stations, here's our list of the top 10 most expensive projects ever. Number 10, Hong Kong International Airport, US $31 billion. Hong Kong International Airport is not only one of the busiest airports in the world, but is also one of the most expensive airports ever built. The massive project, completed in 1998, included four sponsors, 10 separate projects, 225 construction contracts, and over 1,000 critical interfaces. Now that's a pretty large project. The airport itself covers 12.48 square kilometers of reclaimed land, which increased the total land area of Hong Kong by 1%. Inside the airport, it has 288 check-in counters, 200 immigration desks, 2.5 kilometers of moving walkways, and around 120 shops. No wonder why it costs $31 billion in today's money to construct. Number 9. Kansai International Airport, US $34 billion. Kansai International Airport just beats Hong Kong on our list by $3 billion and is the world's most expensive airport ever built. Located on an artificial island in the middle of Osaka Bay, Osaka, Japan, Kansai Airport is the world's first ocean airport. The construction of this entire island by scratch is an engineering sensation. Completed in 1994, Kansai's airport was formed by using 178 million cubic tons of earth taken by nearby mountains. Add in millions of cubic meters of concrete and you have one large project. Due to this complex nature of this project, over 10,000 people had worked to complete the airport. That's a lot of resource management right there. Number 8. The Beijing Shanghai High Speed Railway US $36 billion the Beijing to Shanghai train, also known as the bullet train, is the world's fastest passenger train which travels at a crazy speed of 350 kilometers per hour, making the long journey between Beijing and Shanghai take only four hours to complete. The railway project took just three years to complete and that included the construction of 244 bridges, 22 tunnels as well as over 500 sensory equipment. An estimated 130,000 construction workers were working during the peak phase of construction. During this project, a few painstaking tests were ran, in which multiple trains tested the tracks by hitting speed records of up to 487 kilometers per hour. Now that must have been a nerve-wracking testing phase. Number seven, Songdo International Business District, US 40 billion plus. Songdo International Business District, is a new city in South Korea known as the world's smartest city. Built from scratch, the city sits on 600 hectares of reclaimed land southwest of Seoul. The city is designed around technology and sustainability. Computers are built into streets and buildings to help with traffic and to let neighbours have video calls. Yes, really. Sensors are used to collect data and smartly manage assets and resources around the city. So as you can see, building an entirely new city made with the latest smart technology isn't going to be a cheap project and since it's been over 15 years since the project began and more than half the city is still yet to be built you can see why we added that plus on that 40 billion dollar price tag number six dubai land us 88 billion dollars dubai land is an entertainment complex in dubai which was announced in 2003 with an ambitious price tag the complex is targeted towards families and would include luxurious leisure activities such as Disney theme parks, IMAX theatres and shopping malls. The project hit a large speed bump during the financial crisis in 2008. Dubai Land was put on hold and it took another 5 years before the project resumed in 2013. I hope they had that covered in their risk management planning. The park officially opened in December 2016 and is currently in its fourth and final stage of development with the completion happening sometime in 2020. Number 5. California High Speed Rail Forecasted to be US $98 billion the California High Speed Rail is a railway being built between Los Angeles and San Francisco. The trains are planned to travel at 350 km per hour, which is the same as the Beijing to Shanghai bullet train. The journey will take only two and a half hours to connect California's two largest cities. 
The groundbreaking ceremony for construction took place in January 2015, with Phase 1, which connects Los Angeles and San Francisco, is expected to be complete in 2029. Other phases to connect San Diego and Las Vegas are also planned. The forecast for this massive project is currently at $98 billion, but it could go even higher in the coming years. Number 4. King Abdullah Economic City US $100 billion King Abdullah Economic City, also known as the KAEC, is a brand new next generation city located on the coast of the Red Sea in Saudi Arabia. The city is designed and split into six components, an industrial zone, a large port, a residential zone, an educational area, a sea resort and a central business district. Just imagine how many project managers are needed for all of those. Very similar to the Songdo district. The KAEC is 14 years into the project and still less than half the city has been built, even when the completion was expected to happen in 2020. King Abdullah Economic City has a planned population of 2 million people, however currently only 100,000 people live in the next generation city. Number 3. Kashigan Fields US $129 billion Kashigan Fields, located in the Caspian Sea, 80 kilometers offshore of Kazakhstan, is one of the most challenging oil projects ever undertaken. An offshore oil field, poised with the challenge of a harsh sea environment, makes this the most expensive and technically difficult oil project ever. With shallow water depths of 3 to 4 meters, this tough project began in 2001 and it took 12 years before commercial production began in September 2013. It is being operated in a joint venture by some of the biggest gas companies in the world such as Shell, Total and ExxonMobil. While the project had an estimated budget of $55 billion, sources believe Kashigan Fields had a development cost of $116 billion in 2012, placing it third on our list. Number 2. The International Space Station US $150 billion The International Space Station, known as the ISS, is a joint project between the United States' NASA, Russia's Roscosmos, Japan's JAXA, Europe's ESA and Canada's CSA. Sitting in low Earth orbit, the ISS is the most expensive multinational collaborative project ever with the components for the project made by the different space agencies in various countries all over the world. With all these components of the space station being developed in 15 different countries, problems such as language difficulties, differences in equipment, processes and management makes this a project I would not have liked to manage. The first part of the space station was launched in 1998, four years after the first component started manufacturing in Russia. Two years later, in November 2000, the ISS welcomed its first resident crew, Expedition 1, containing three astronauts who stayed for 136 days. The International Space Station continues to fly by us each day, completing 15.5 orbits every day. Number 1. The Interstate Highway System US $538 billion The most expensive project of all time took 40 years to plan and 35 years to complete. Wow! Planning for the construction of a network of highways in the United States began in 1916 by the government, but it wasn't until 1956 when the system was strongly backed by US President Dwight D. Eisenhower. Eisenhower signed the Federal Aid Highway Act of 1956, which proposed a program that would build divided highways linking all American cities with a population of 50,000 or more. 35 years later, in 1992, the interstate highway system was finally completed with the I-70 in Colorado being opened in October of that year. With a project of this ridiculous budget and crazy timescale, developed in an era without the modern day computer, makes us feel extremely lucky that we have project management tools like Soda to help us out. So that's our list. Do you know of any other extremely expensive projects that we missed? Please let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to get notified. Oh, and that Soda tool I keep talking about? Head on over to our website to schedule a free personalized demo with our CEO so he can show you how Soda can benefit you and your organization.